Last week on Ready, Set, Renovate, we showed you the massive 15-month makeover featured at this year's International Builder Show. Florida-based builder Victor Farina was chosen by the National Association of Home Builders to renovate his very own 1937 traditional-style home into this stunning show place. Today, we talked to industry pros who toured the renovation and asked the Farina family what it's like to live in a home worthy of an international spotlight. HB International Builder Show was held in Orlando this year. It's the industry's premier event showcasing the top manufacturers and suppliers of innovative new products for your home. One of the favorites at IBS is the new American Remodel that demonstrates how a 1930s traditional style home can be transformed for contemporary living using today's products and building techniques. As showcased in last week's Ready Set Renovate episode, the new American Remodel for this year highlighted a Farina & Sons renovation. Visitors of the International Builder Show had a chance to tour the newly renovated home that just happens to be the home the Farina family has owned and lived in for the past 14 years. We came down to look at the kitchen and bath industry, see what's new, what's fresh. We both design a lot of kitchens, design a lot of bathrooms. We do home renovations. So that's what brought us to the remodeler's house as well. This is one of the best parts of coming to KBiz and the, and the IBS show. It is invigorating to be able to see what they can do to a remodel. It ties it all together. It shows us things in, in the situation that we might be putting it in, and it calls attention to some things that we might not have noticed at the show. In, a, you know, in an environment that's a convention center, it's not always obvious what things are. My eyes were rolling in the back of my head on every turn. It, we, it, they, just what they've done is amazing. What was your favorite thing? I have to say some of the usage of high vaulted ceilings and the ceiling treatments, it, it's, it's like there's so much attention and focus placed on every part of the room. What about the kitchen? The kitchen with two islands, enough room for the cook to see out into the view, having places for everybody to entertain, gigantic refrigerators, freezers, uh, wine, re wine coolers, and then having that huge pantry right at your ready, unbelievable. I would say my favorite thing right now, just because it's always what you're working on, were the, um, the rolling s screens, the really overscale sizes, and the way the tracks go inside the walls and things like that. I think that thing that I noticed most was the use of technology. I think that's a big thing in the industry. As we age as designers, we need to keep up on technology for the younger clients that are expecting that more, that are coming up in their 30s. I work in the second home industry, so I'm starting now to have clients that are younger than me that expect the technology a little bit more, so I want to keep up on that. Some of the lighting, the different uses of the LED lighting in the different spaces, um, the home center um, with, you know, the TV screen with the technology where they're able to access everything. Um, I think when you're doing a luxury industry, there's so many lights to turn off in your house when you're leaving to go home after being there for the weekend, which is what most of my clients are doing. So being able to push one button, turn everything off, I think is a pretty important thing for them versus walking around the whole house, turning every single light off. Um, so I think that's kind of becoming expected and a necessity in these houses. There's been this trend towards the large format tiles um, and that's one that I'm planning to use on a project I've got coming up right now in Ocean City, Maryland. Um, 
and I saw that in several places and I really like that. It really helps me. The clients love to know that I'm on top of the trends, seeing what's out here. They get excited when I show them pictures and come back and say, look what I've just seen. They, they absolutely love it. So it's like inspiring for the whole industry. It's an inspiration that lasts an entire year and as you're fading down and you need another uplift, the show comes around again. I think really when you get the next new project, you think back, it comes to you again. Things that I didn't necessarily notice this time will come back. It always has historically. I enjoyed this home a little more than the other because of the historic nature of it. Um, I really like the use of the reclaimed wood flooring where they were taking wine barrels and stripping them down and using a wood veneer. It's a, a great green way to recycle things. Um, and then the use of the different coffered ceilings and the details that they really paid attention to. I felt like this house was really livable and the spaces were cozy, um, which is more in keeping with like the New England homes that I work on. Coming up next on Ready, Set, Renovate, we talked to Victor and Karen to see how they felt about the show and the hundreds of visitors who took the tour of their home. All that and more when Ready, Set, Renovate returns. Hi, I'm Elizabeth Hart from Ready, Set, Renovate, here today with my good friend Tat Granada from Florida Home Improvement Associates. Tat, you're always bringing us great information, but today you have great deals. We do. We have a great deal today. Thanks to one of our manufacturers, they're giving us a tremendous upgrade opportunity for everyone who moves forward with a window project and moves forward with an energy-efficient glass pack. They're going to upgrade it at no additional charge with a free sound and security glass pack. So it's a tremendous value. If we call now, we can still have time to get it installed for this season. Everybody, we're here today with Tat Granada again from Florida Home Improvement Associates. Welcome back, Tat. Great to see you. Great seeing you again. So you guys are here on a window install today, and we're in town. So this homeowner isn't concerned about hurricane impact, but they are concerned about safety and energy efficiency. Yeah, those were the key points when we met with this family that they really wanted us to try to address. Um, because of the association, we had to meet the requirements to stick with a bronze color frame. So it limited our choices a little bit, and we ended up going with a great product from Custom Window Systems that's going to really help them achieve the energy efficiency they are looking for, as well as uh, the security they also wanted. We have a dedicated uh, department of our company to, to handle all associations throughout Florida. So uh, when it comes to a bronze frame, we know exactly the type of products that we can uh, suggest to the homeowners to exactly fit what the requirements are going to be for the association. So we have the old window over here. Your crew has already removed it, and you can actually see some significant differences between this one and the new window that's going into place. This is an aluminum frame. Yeah, absolutely. This was the original uh, window that was put in the home when the home was built, and it's an aluminum frame, so it's not going to give you the energy efficiency that they wanted. Uh, it's going to conduct the heat throughout the frame. Also, it was just a single pane piece of glass, so there was no energy efficiency in the glass pack, and there's certainly no protection for security as well. Right. So over here we have the new window, and this is a vinyl frame, so it's... Yep very long lasting and the beautiful part about this is because you want something sturdy you want something strong that's also safe but you want something that looks good and so you have the color requirement on the outside but then the homeowner gets their color of choice which is white for the trim on the inside yeah they wanted to go with the white on the interior just because it brightens up the room a little bit but we had to meet the requirement on the exterior also, the great thing about this product is it comes with a lifetime warranty, so they're never going to have to replace it again. Uh, if anything, it's guaranteed against fading or discoloring or anything. Well worth the money. Yeah. All right. Thanks so much. Tat Granada from Florida Home Improvement Associates. 90% of all nursing homes in America have at least one employee with a criminal record. At daycares and even doggy daycares, cameras monitor activity all day long not at nursing homes. I'm Matt Morgan of Morgan & Morgan. Our loved ones are warehoused today at record numbers, and the abuse goes on. Bed sores, falls, malnutrition, and yes, even death. Call us for more information about your legal rights. Morgan & Morgan, for the people .com. When disaster strikes, when duty calls, and when others are in need, they go first. Now it's time to put them first. Ford thanks those who go further for all of us. First responders, all military personnel, veterans and retirees can now get appreciation cash on top of all other public offers. All from Ford, America's best selling brand. Visit FordSalutesThoseWhoServe.com.
Enjoy your life without worrying about termites or the damage they cause. Call Peninsular today for a free inspection and recommendation for treatment. of marine biologists in Florida learning the language of dolphins. You think that's amazing? The Florida Lottery has awarded over 775,000 Bright Future scholarships to help students like Carly McGregor achieve their dreams. See Carly's story and others at flalottery.com slash brightfutures. Now that the show is over and the Farina family has moved into their newly renovated home, I had a chance to sit down with Victor and Carrot to see how they felt about the hundreds of people who had a chance to take a tour of their home during this year's International Builder Show. At that point, I don't know how Victor feels, but at that point, it felt like our project, but it didn't feel like it was our home yet because we had not moved back in. It was so different. It is so different than where we started. So to me, it was kind of all business at that point. I mean, we were proud. We were excited, but we weren't worried about so many people because, you know, it's it's just stuff that will hold up. You know, they cleaned it afterwards and all that. So, I don't know, it wasn't like having a thousand people walk into your home exactly. Mm -hmm. You know, now that we've moved in, it might feel a little different, <laughs> but I don't know. You know, we've been doing Parade of Homes and things like that for so long. It's it, doesn't seem that strange to us. Yeah, these homes are uh, a good chance to brag, uh, show off your uh, work. Uh, there's a lot of people that will come see it in the business or the trade, but also it's a chance to be a model home and show this to all your customers. And that's what we've been doing ever since the end of October. Actually, we did it all through the construction. I had homeowners, prospective homeowners, uh, that would come through and take a look at the different products in a rough state, you know, or now in the last few months in a finished day. So just yesterday we were, we walked around for about an hour and a half meeting with a uh, person who's going to do a new construction on the other side of town. So it worked out just fine and she loved everything. It's not that this style will match everybody's taste, but they get tidbits of everything. Renovating a home in general is challenging. But add the pressure of a builder show and the inconvenience of having to live right next door to the construction. It's great for me because I wasn't the builder, you know. <laughs> um, you know, these type of projects are always going to push you, being the owner and that we were, and the timing was going to push you. If we could have took three years to do it, it would have been just a piece of cake two years to do it. But it had to be done in a short period of time. All the vendors had to produce what they wanted to show. Uh, Karen and Grant had to make all the selections for the finishes, which I believe I've told you before, I, many things I did not know. I didn't know the tile color, I didn't know the, the countertop or the cabinets or any, I didn't even know the plumbing fixtures. I knew they were Kohler, but I didn't know what they looked like. So um, with that team effect we had with Grant, the uh, interior designer, and Mark, the architect, as well as Scott Redman outside for the landscape, artscape architect, you know, these are people I've used that are so proven, I've used so many times before, that it just made the job easier. M make no mistake, it's a very tough job to do, and again, in a short period of time, and making sure all the vendors are in line, but, um, you know, it's just something you keep pushing through, and it is stressful, but again, one of the things that was a, a huge advantage was living right next door. I mean, that was huge. My and the closer we got to the end of the project, that really came into play. Because decisions, things, things every day, something would come up and let's meet over here, go go grab this. So being right next door was was huge. It was such a convenience. When asked if the International Builder Show team requirements restricted any creativity. Everything we were gonna do, they let it they let us do. The only thing they weren't real kicked up about is me bringing all my mounts up to the room up there. So I don't know how you show all this, but all the animal mounts, they didn't. They thought we might be a little, it could have been one or two deer head, you know, they said. 
But of course, as you know, it has a theme of animal uh, with the doors, the leather on the doors looking like uh, um, the belly of an alligator. So it uh, has the theme, but that was the only thing they said. You know, otherwise, what we chose, they liked very much. I mean, there, it really was not a conflict at all. Um, we had plenty of products to choose from, and there was nothing that we really wanted to do that they, that they had a problem with. So, I mean, I, I think it really all worked out. Now that their home has been renovated and the show is over, what's next for the Farina & Sons builders and remodelers? We keep promoting it and keep showing it to prospective buyers. Uh, we're going to have the Parade of Homes here, uh, which, will, which will gather quite a few people in two days. Um, and we're going to, after some of that, again, we're going to have the vendors, if they want to throw a party or something, a private event, we can do that. Um, but we're going to relax. We're going to rest and relax. So. Next up on Ready, Set, Renovate, we hear from the Farina children to see how they feel about their newly renovated home and what their parents have accomplished. Whose house is this? I definitely do not live here anymore. Um. <laughs> It's good to have options. That's why the Florida Lottery offers over 70 scratch-offs with more than $33 billion in prizes paid. The Florida Lottery, it's your ticket. Are you tired of stinky water? <laughs> Iron stains? Hard water? Or the nasty tasting chlorine in your water? Don't live with those annoying water problems any longer. Call now and take advantage of this limited time introductory offer. Try any Connecticut non electric water system for only $9.95 per month. 800 633 7114 or cgcwater.com. June 9th is the date for the Mario Butler Foundation Football and Cheer Camp. The registration is free for girls ages 5 through 14 and boys ages 5 through 17. Camp participants get a free t-shirt, lunch, and a chance to meet NFL players. Sign up today at MarioButlerFoundation.org. Now is the time to get moving in a Claude Nolan Cadillac XT5. Lease for only $349 per month or buy with 0% financing for 60 months. Visit us today for your test drive and see why we merit rave reviews. Claude Nolan Cadillac, beyond expectations. Weather can turn deadly in the blink of an eye. Priority one, always tracking, keeping you safe. Pinpointing the worst weather, neighborhood by neighborhood. Alerting you before the storm, no matter where you are. I'm severe weather ready for you. The Weather Authority. Always watching. Always trying. Hi, I'm Elizabeth Hart from Ready, Set, Renovate, here today with my good friend Tat Granada from Florida Home Improvement Associates. Tat, you're always bringing us great information, but today you have great deals. We do. We have a great deal today. Thanks to one of our manufacturers, they're giving us a tremendous upgrade opportunity for everyone who moves forward with a window project and moves forward with an energy-efficient glass pack. They're going to upgrade it at no additional charge with a free sound and security glass pack. So it's a tremendous value. If we call now, we can still have time to get installed for this season. So this has been a long journey. It took about, what, 15 months for this all to be completed. How does it feel at the end of it, Karen? I, I can't believe I get to live here. <laughs> it, it's great. It, it feels like home, but it's, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's amazing. Tori, this is, you know, the house where you spent most of your childhood. And to see it as it is right now, I mean, yeah, do you just walk around and think this? I, I can't believe this is the same house. Whose house is this? I definitely do not live here anymore. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Are you irritated with your parents that they waited until after you moved out? Uh, slightly, but I see their reasoning. Uh, <laughs> there might have been more sleepovers or get togethers that would have ruined the. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Integrity of the home. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Well, I think they have visions but, of, you know, the day that they have grandchildren and, you know, their grandchildren are coming here for holidays and things like yeah, that. Those will stay visions probably <laughs> for a while. <laughs> <laughs> so, Jason, um, you were here and you worked on this project. You helped out. And, um, I mean, what do you think? 
Oh, I love it. And like, there's just so much hard work put into it that like, you know, many people don't really understand unless you really look at the detail and stuff. So it's just took a long time, but it still looks like somewhat what the house used to, you know, yeah, but it it's just, feels like it's just all like updated yeah. and everything. It's yeah, it's amazing. So Tori, you're, um, you know, a young adult out in the working world now and, and you're thinking about getting your first home. So I'm sure you look around here and there are a lot of inspiring things, right? What, if you could take pieces of this house and put it in your potential new house, what would you take? Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Everything. I think now uh, the openness, I like the ceiling height. It just feels very open and airy and clean. I do not like a lot of clutter and I really appreciate the nice countertops. So I feel like the ceiling heights, the countertops, and I like a lot of the coloring too. A lot of the details like the dark wood and then the light wood and the slight color variations with the cabinets. Is this a house that you see staying in the family for generations? I do. In a perfect, <laughs> in a perfect world. <laughs> As I said. In their perfect world, yes. <laughs> it might be a commune at that point. Yeah. <laughs> you know, well, they have a different, of... different wings, you know. Yeah. What do you think Papa would think? Oh, he would love, oh my, yeah. I know, he, he would. He always wanted Victor to renovate his own house. You know, we had other opportunities that came up to take a house down or move here or something. It's like, you can't buy a new house. You gotta, you gotta do your own house. And, you know, he felt really strongly about that. Yeah. And I know he'd be so, so proud of this project and just where he's taken the business. So. Now that the family has had a chance to move into the home and has had time to enjoy some of the upgraded amenities, Karen Farina takes us on a personal tour of the kitchen to show us some of her favorite appliances. Stay tuned. Ready, set, renovate. We'll be right back. Race on in to Campers Inn RV of Jacksonville and rev up your summer with your dream RV. We're leaving the competition in the dust with unbeatable deals on motorhomes, travel trailers, fifth wheels, and more, like a 2018 FR3 30 DS for just $89,995. Plus, you'll receive a $1,000 gas card with purchase of a new FR3. Put the pedal to the metal because these incredible bargains are moving fast. Visit Campers Inn of Jacksonville, I-10, exit 351, the RVer's trusted resource, or CampersInn.com today. Over the past couple of weeks, we've shown you an incredible transformation of this 1937 two-story home into an international showpiece. And joining us now is the owner of this gorgeous new home. Hey, Karen Freed, how are you? Hello, I'm great, how are you? Good, so you and I met a while back when you were just starting this renovation, and this was your home that you lived in with your family for quite some time. Mm -hmm. And uh, all those months ago, you and I were standing in your kitchen with sledgehammers, taking down that wall right. that had been blocking sunlight from your kitchen and making it impossible for you to entertain the way you wanted to. But mm -hmm. my, how times have changed. Yes, they have, <laughs> that was a happy day. <laughs> here, here we are in your gorgeous new kitchen yeah, and I mean I don't even know where to look everything's so pretty it's it's a lot it's a little overwhelming but the um, the appliances kind of anchor everything mm -hmm. and um, this 60 inch range and the um, beautiful hood that goes along with it and the custom-made uh, zinc decorative feature over it um, that has been really just special it's kind of made the kitchen special to us. It is yeah. stunning. I mean, your eye can't help but be drawn to it. That was made by a local artisan here in Central it Florida. Was. And all the appliances are done by Thermador. So you've got six burners, you've got the double ovens, you've got the griddle. I can cook for the whole neighborhood. <laughs> yeah, so everything turned out great. And EJM Copper here in town did a great job. That's um, zinc, hammered zinc. Mm -hmm. So. Um, just love everything. So the next thing you need to go with this gorgeous meal you're going to cook on the stove, of course, is a new wine fridge, right? Of course, of <laughs> course. So for parties and other things, uh, we're really enjoying our wine column here. It's large. It's <laughs> quite accommodating. So it has three different zones, okay. uh, different temperatures, long-term storage, uh, 
daily, all, all, whatever you need, it's there. And it's been great because, you know, we do have some nice wines we want to save for the future, but it just makes everything so convenient. So. Yeah, I'm we're, sure when you, it. you live in a house like this and you're entertaining, people expect you to have, you know, some higher end wine. So this allows you to preserve it and it the temperature is regulated in the zones that's appropriate for that right. type of wine. And a lot of people bring us wine when they come to the house or for parties. So it's nice to be able to have a good place to put it. And plenty of space. There are tons of shelves there on there are, as well. They pull out and there's, you know, there's a display shelf so it's everything you could want <laughs> and it's nestled in between what behind this cabinetry are two is a giant refrigerator and a giant freezer right 36 inches each of them so uh, we wanted to panel it because we didn't want to look that commercial right <laughs> industrial so um, yeah we, we love the way that the wine column breaks up the other two appliances. And that was one of the things that we talked about early on in this renovation is because you have a large extended family. In your old kitchen, you didn't have enough counter space, you didn't have enough refrigerator storage right. to entertain the way you wanted to. No, but no I, we didn't. We had a refrigerator, extra refrigerator in the garage. <laughs> um, we were on top of each other. But this this is amazing. This is a complete 180 in the other direction, it I would is. imagine. It is, it yeah. is. Okay, so what you need to complement all this beautiful high-end cooking and refrigeration, of course, is something speedy, right? A mm -hmm. microwave. Uh-huh, for all those yummy leftovers. Yeah. So we do use our microwave quite a bit. Um, it comes in handy for all the leftovers and all the yummy meals that I'm cooking all the time in this kitchen. and. Uh, it's a really nice size, it's easy, and there's a warming drawer underneath, too. Okay, you also have uh, whatever kitchen needs, a coffee machine, right? Yes. <laughs> so wonderful. We, uh, we weren't 100% how much we were going to use it, but every day we use it. It's lovely. We can make anything we want, and um, it's just great. It tells you everything you need to do. Lattes, espressos, and coffee, which is right there, right? Correct. Would you like some? I would love some. Uh, Thanks so much. All right. Karen Farina, your home is stunning. Thank you so much for letting us follow along you're and welcome. congratulations. Thank you. Thanks. I'm Tacker Auto with Florida Home Improvements, and today we're with Steve and we're here at his installation. Uh, things are going really well today. They're doing absolutely a lot more work than I thought was uh, to do this, but yeah, doing a great job. Yeah, we were talking earlier about uh, how happy you were with how everything's were going, and what were some of the reasons why you decided to uh, move forward with the project? Well, I think you had some good people that uh, first came out here to present your product, and I said uh, we did some in interviews, and uh, we also did some research on the internet to look at what the products are. And you have one heck of a warranty, better than the, the industry that I've seen before. Um, and your reputation was good. We have a great relationship with several different manufacturers, but one in particular gives us a great warranty option if the homeowner likes that window. With custom window systems, the product is fully guaranteed for lifetime and it's transferable to the next homeowner. That's that, that is important from my perspective, and that was the tipping scale. Okay. Uh, one of the reasons you wanted to change out your windows you had, you had discussed earlier was what you, you had noticed that it was the original construction and you were starting to have problems with it? Yeah, we were having some problems with it. It looks like the caulking starting to give way. And these were single pane glass when we first installed them back in 1978. And uh, the other part was we're tired of trying to put plywood up every time we had uh, a wind blowing over 40 miles an hour out here. So this gives me a peace of mind. You're good. Yeah. You ordered great hurricane windows. And I love the fact that we went with the bronze frame and it's fully guaranteed. If it were to fade or discolor, it's fully guaranteed. And also, you went with an energy-efficient glass pack, too. It's going to make your home a little bit more comfortable. Because we have a lot of glass in the property, and so that was really important for us to deal with that. Again, the reputation really preceded you, and that's one of the reasons we came with it. I really appreciate it. I know with our relationship with the wholesale clubs, we're able to come in with a, a competitive pricing that really helps to be, have that association with the wholesale clubs and provides us the great relationships with the manufacturers as well. Right. So we appreciate you choosing Florida Home Improvements, and I'm glad everything's going so well. Right.